hi and welcome to this channel let's go and install node.js and npm on windows 11 the process is also exactly the same for windows 10 so if you are using windows 10 you can follow the video open your browser type node.js download and enter Download Node.js from Node.js.org Here you have the selected boxes. You can select your operating system and your system type For example Windows, Mac OS, Linux, AIX We are using Windows and my system type is 64 to find out your system type, go to the settings, Windows plus I, and then to the system, at the end you have about, click on about, here you see system type, 64 bit operating system, X64 based processor. So, based on that, you can select it, your system architecture 64 or 86 or ARM64 click on Windows installer very nice go to your download folder download now you do need this close it double click on the installer welcome to the node.js setup wizard click on next accept the terms and license agreement then click on next destination folder you can change it if you want and click on next here are the modules that you can choose core package manager npm package manager online documentation shortcuts and r2 path will be installed on the local hard drive entire feature will be installed on local hard drive and you can entire feature will be unavailable if you don't want a module, you can select it. Entire feature will be unavailable. Then click on Next. Tools for native modules. Some MPM modules need to be compiled from C or C++ when installing. If you want to be able to install such modules, some tools such as Python and Visual Studio Build tools need to be installed now leave this as it is do not check this because it will install also many chunks if you would need any other tools in the future you can install them manually using uh, your terminal it is very simple and easy click on next now click on install Completed the Node.js setup wizard. Click on finish. Close it. Open your terminal. Open in terminal. Node hyphen hyphen version. And also npm hyphen hyphen version. For security purposes, you cannot run PowerShell scripts. As you see this file, npm.ps1 is a PowerShell file. And for that, you have to set the execution policy. So you have to run it as administrator probably. Set execution policy. 
execution policy then you have all signed bypass default remote signed restricted undefined unrestricted so the best one is remote signed run as administrator so open powershell powershell run as administrator close that one execution policy execution policy remote sign yes yes to all yes and now if you run npm hyphen hyphen version you get the npm version Congratulations, you have successfully installed the latest version of Node.js and NPM on your computer. That's it guys, I hope it was helpful. I have published many courses, tutorials, tips, tricks, hackers that can help you with your career, with your studies and with your daily life. So make sure to watch my other videos as well. Thanks for watching, take care and have beautiful times.